Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is how to create MIDI guitar slides in Cakewalk. So here I have a Cakewalk project with a drum track and an empty MIDI track that is linked to a guitar preset on a TTS-1 virtual instrument track. Now you could use a MIDI keyboard with a pitch wheel to create slides, but here I'm going to show you how to quickly add a slide to a note using the event list. So first, right mouse click the record section of the MIDI track. Move the mouse cursor over view on the pop-up menu. Then click on piano roll view. Now double click on the grid in the piano roll view to add a note. If you haven't placed the note at the beginning of the track, you might want to make note of the ruler position. Now right mouse click the record section of the MIDI track again. Move the mouse cursor over view on the pop-up menu. And this time click on event list. Here I only have one event. The note I just added to the piano roll view. But notice that the ruler position is shown just here in the MBT column. So I know it is the right note. Now click on the number in the MBT column of the note. Then click on the plus icon. The note has now been duplicated in the event list. Now double click on note on the duplicate event. Then click on the circle to the left of the words Pitch Wheel on the pop-up menu. Then click on OK. For this slide, we are going to slide up to the note. So double click on the number in the data column and type in minus 8192. and then press enter on your keyboard. Now at this point I should say that the amount of pitch change is controlled by the virtual instrument you are using and not by the pitch wheel MIDI events. The MIDI pitch wheel events just set a relative number where minus 8192 is the maximum downward pitch bend possible. Now click on the plus icon nine times. Then double click on the MBT column of the last event and change the last three numbers to 480. This sets the end of the slide to the eighth note. So it is in sync with the beat. Now double click on the data column and type in zero. This sets the pitch back to the key pitch. Now move up the events list, changing the MBT column so each number is 30 less than the one below it until you reach 240.
Now set the data column for the wheel event as follows. Minus 8192, minus 8000, minus 7800, minus 7300, minus 6500, minus 5000, minus 2500, minus 1000, minus 500, and zero. And that's it. Now, click on the X icon to close the events list. And here I've used the guitar slide along with other notes for the guitar track. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.